Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, we are dedicating this show to Ray Bedard. And if Ray was here, he'd really enjoy this. So, Ray, this one's for you, baby. All right. To begin with, he always liked to see me levitate. Only for you folks on this side. Watch. Let me just... Watch. Ooh. Hey? Pretty good. I'll do it again. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. You people on this side. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa! You people in the middle, watch this. Hey! Whoa! Hey, I'm cheating. Look, I'm grabbing the pole over here. Whoa! This is fun. Whee! Whee! <laughs> All right, we're not here to watch me be silly, so I want to show you how I started in magic. And, um, oh, I have a cracker right over here in my pocket. Yeah. Let me just take that out, several crackers, and I'll just tear that open here. Yeah, and um, throw that on the floor. It could be my uh, floor show. And I'm gonna go like this, and yeah, yeah, I'll get rid of that. And there, okay. So, watch the cracker very carefully. I simply place it right into my fist, like this. I use what we call Woofle dust. Watch. Little woofle dust. <laughs> and the cracker disappears! Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah. When I first started doing magic, I like to make things vanish. Oh, I got one in my pocket over here. Silk? Yes, indeed. I'll use this yellow silk. Now watch this. All I do is I take it and I simply tuck it right into my fist. As I do, like a mirage, I just tuck it in here like this and it will go wave on it instantly. It disappears just like that. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah. Now, to bring it back, I just have to go like this, snap my finger, say PCM, and instantly the silk comes right back. But wait. I'll do more. I'll do it once again. Now watch. I'm going to take it, simply tuck it in. This time, I'm going to let it shoot up my sleeve, go across my manly chest, and down the other side, like this. Ta-da! Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes. So, um, I have a, I think I have a bill somewhere. Yeah, what a mess here like this. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> Now, I was watching Jack Chow doing this earlier, but Jack is quite a bit taller than me, you see? And so, you can see I have a $20 bill. This is the front, this is the back, like so. And uh, here, I'll turn it the other way so it's face up. There we go. Now, and so, what I'm gonna do is simply fold this five times. This is, this is once, this is twice, this is uh, three times, watch, four times, I simply blow on it, PCAM, instantly as I open it up, it changes from a $20 bill to a $100 bill. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you very much. Oh, yeah, too easy. Now, to change it back, the front, the back, I'm going to fold it like this. All I do is I simply blow on it, PCAM, and look, it changes back to the $20 dollar bill. Oh, yeah. All right. Thank you. Now, I'm going to tuck this in my pocket. Save it for later. And um, I like doing cards. I happen to have some cards right over here. In fact, I, I counted six cards here earlier. Have them right in my pocket. I'll, just get all, I'll put that soap down there. And, uh, oh. Yeah. Now, if you watch very carefully, I saw a magician performing at the McPherson Theater, where we're going to be going tomorrow. And at the McPherson Theater, he showed one, two, three, four, five, and six cards. And what he did was he threw away one, two, three of those cards, and he still ended up with one, two, three, four, five, and six cards. And I thought, oh, that's fantastic. So I went backstage and I, I knocked on his door. I said, hey, can you, I'm learning magic. Can you teach me the trick, that card trick you did? He says, which one was it? I said, the one where you take one, two, three, four, 
five and six cards, you throw away one, two, three cards, and you end up with one, two, three, four, five, and six cards. And so he says, oh, that's a magical trade secret. He says, I can't show that to you. And um, if I did, I'd, I'd be banned from magic. But if you go down to the local magic shop, I'm sure they will show you. So I went down to <coughs> Tony Stricken Joke Shop. <laughs> 688 Broughton, and I said to the man behind the counter, can you show me the trick where you show one, two, three, four, five, and six cards? You throw away one, two, three of those cards, and you end up with one, two, three, four, five, and six cards. He said, oh, I'm terribly sorry. I just sold out of that. Ah, but I got one that like this, where you show one, two, three, four, five, and six cards, you throw away one, two, three, four, five, and six cards, you end up with only one, two, three cards. But I don't have the one where you show one, two, three, four, five, and six cards, you throw away one, two, three cards, and you end up with one, two, six, <laughs> Well, I got lost there, didn't I? Okay. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. And if you ask me, I think that's impossible. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Once again, for not only Tony Eng, but Julie Eng as well, give them both a nice big... Uh, And, uh, but I don't, Tony did that, uh, Tony's done that act before, and, uh, and Julie, and um, we just found out that uh, they're going to be booked in December, 